All right, so the last tournament we had out here, we, um, you know, we didn't place too good, but a lot of the guys that were catching them, we're catching them on umbrella rigs, um, swim baits, and we got a few on that, not much wacky rigs. So I went out, because there was a bunch of schooling, and I bought uh, these live target bait ball spinner rigs. I'm gonna try that out. We're sitting in about like, I think eight to 12 feet right now. And there's a bunch of grass down there coming up to about five to six feet. And I'm just gonna toss that around. We're out here in the middle, got a nice breeze and I'm gonna see if I can pick something up. All right, so first looks at it. Doesn't look awful. Has a lot of vibration. Know, this is the half ounce sitting around like 10 feet right now. I'm just gonna chuck this around and see if I can pick up on some feeding feeding bass or pickerel. A lot of pickerel and musky in here too. There's one. Oh, I came off. No, that's the only thing that sucks. You said Bennett. It only has that one hook. Well, that's a good sign. First five minutes. I think this might be one of those baits where you have to let them take it more. There it is. Where are these largemouth in the tournaments, Cole? All right, there we go. Like the first five minutes, you just smoked it. You know, it's not the biggest one, it's like a pound and a half -er, but these tournaments we've been having here, um, Fish like that matter. Like 10 pounds wins. Like occasionally you get your 13 pound bag, but this is a small fish lake. So a lot of fish like that matter. found this break off out here in front of me by this buoy and it goes in from like 13 feet to like 8 and there's like just a straight drop off there's a contour in the structure there was one There's one. Yeah. Get the net. Ooh. Over here. He hit it when I was swimming it. There we go. Where are these at, Dorn? I know. Where are these during the tournament? Ripped it through the grass. There we go. Hit the net rig. There we go. Nice little short chunky one. There's one. 
Yep. Look at that. Oh, another keeper bass. There we go. There's number two on this. I've been missing a bunch, but... Oh, there was one. It's coming at me with it. Black. Yeah. Feels good. Yeah. He's swimming at me with it. Oh. I hope it's a big small mouth. I do. It is. This is only six pound test. <laughs> Look out, look out. Oh my gosh, Cole. Come on, go, 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 go. Oh, 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 oh my freaking gosh. gosh. What a net rig. Jeez, that's eight. I caught that on a net rig. On seven, I mean six pound test. A net rig on six pound test. Oh my gosh. He wasn't going anywhere. All right, we're gonna get a weight on him. Oop, wrong one. <laughs> Look at that. It's an absolute giant. Too bad we can't ever have these in our tournament. Four, nine, six. Five pounds. Alright. So now look at them. We'll let them go. All right, little midday update. Um, we've been fishing probably a look. We've been fishing like close to MS three hours now. It's starting to get pretty cloudy out, pretty dark. Um, we're gonna make another run. I think we're gonna try out two more spots before we get off the water. Uh, caught four nice fish so far. Four nice keepers. Probably would have been around nine pounds that one was pretty small probably close to nine ten pounds with those four fish already which is good for this lake because you need that big fish that's what you're fishing for so trying to catch more on that uh live target bait ball but it's not really happening that's kind of what i was making this video about was that to do a review on that but i'm missing a lot i don't like that there's one hook so we're gonna hit two more spots and get at it spot you want to hit that thing that like cliff over there with them trees in the water or go back by the bridge go under the bridge you just pick which one I don't care which one you feel like fishing which one you feel like fishing big jumps comes off like a seven pounder. He'd be a keeper. We would have had a solid bag today. You know that? Well, that's what we're ending our night on. We made a run back here to this cut that's kind of like back under this bridge over there. I don't know how good you can see it. So, main lake's out there. We came back here and it's calm. Like, it's nice out. No one else is back here, but just didn't pan out. So, we're heading out. 
end of the note I caught a five pounder you know he caught a nice pickerel today so can't complain too much but hopefully we do that good in the tournament thanks for watching